the release. <laughs> I tell these bad bitches, accolades, got will, son, no castaway. I'm twice as good, get half the praise. Throw a sniper up and I'll blast away. You ain't getting through me. What's up guys and welcome back to the welcome back and today we are gonna go and look at how to download malware samples or viruses samples or you know where you could get ma malware and stuff like that and download them and run them on your computer and try to destroy your computer whatever alright uh, here are the websites so the first one is malware domain, domain list there, here's, here's the website. I'm not gonna put in the link in the description because <laughs> I'm not responsible for this. I'm not responsible for this if your computer breaks. But you just put the domain there. <laughs> Coffee. <coughs> Still a bit ill. I put the domain there, paste it, and uh, some of them won't work because they're dead links, like. This link right here, alright, uh, let's try this link, and it basically, you know, you know, um, com you know, computer viruses that you download, yeah, it's not working, so, uh, let's just at least download something, Pac-Man, whatever, let's download some Pac-Man, so, let's download some Pac-Man viruses, computer viruses, copy, uh, okay. so, and this is the computer that I uh, just used the text for a scan, but you tried to test me, but it didn't work. Ha! Uh, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, uh, let's go to the second one. The second one is called X Vault MD5. Uh, Open link to this. Uh, yeah, and uh, let's click. Uh, click on the thing. And you download the file, but you need a username and password. So you need to ask them to for the username and password. Check it out. Oh, go back. Virus total. You could open that. Oh, and it says malware. Trojan, spyware pony, and every yeah, it's pretty undetectable that one. That was pretty undetectable. So yeah, <laughs> so yeah, so you have to ask for these, for these uh thing here. The next one is called malware database, and this one I pretty much use because it's the most simplest one. You just copy, and then you just go. Paste it and then this thing go. And uh, yes, they do work, so you just click on this one, and then yeah, you do download the virus right there. And yes, it does contain malware. Allow download, and then you can run it. Yeah, I don't care. Alright, that one worked. Alright, and you can check what it is, I think. Like, click on this. Is from there. From virus total, it says Trojan. Trojan, so this is a Trojan. I well, uh, yeah, this is pretty much detectable, pretty much. Uh, let's go back. Yeah. And you just copy this one. And you just paste the door. Oh, and this one's probably dead. This would be, some of these are dead links. But by the way, this is a very good one. I pretty much use this. And here's the next one I just researched. These three I know, but this one I don't know. Uh, let's look at this offline, offline. Alright. Virus total, alright. Can you download? Uh, no, MD5, you can't download it, but yeah. Oh, wait a minute. These, these, these use viruses. Oh, a copy. I think this would work. So is it? Is it like? Uh, no. I don't know how you download it. Yeah. Oh, there, right. There's a download. Could probably click this. And then, yeah, so you can run them with the save file. And yes, <laughs> this is a computer virus. So yeah. 
I'm not gonna be responsible for putting these. I'm not gonna put these links in the description because obviously I don't think you <coughs> put the link <coughs> from the video. Uh, <coughs> I'm not very well. Sorry, sorry guys, and um, I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.